shooting tonight robbed and run over a purse snatcher targets a woman outside a busy grocery store. But things get even worse when the victim tries to fight back. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaykat is live in Taylor with a video that police hope will catch this guy. Simon? Carolyn and Dave, a woman in her 60s is hospitalized tonight with a broken shoulder and other injuries. And this all happened right here at this Kroger right behind me. Take a close look at this surveillance video just released by police. There's a man approaching a woman at her vehicle and asking to borrow her cell phone. But seconds later, he grabs the wallet out of her lap and heads for his own Jeep. When the 64 year old Taylor woman tries to get into his SUV, she's run over as he gets away. You always have to be aware of people trying to commit ruses against you. We need to find this person. Uh, next time they might become more violent. They might not just try to escape. It might actually physically assault you or, or worse. This cowardly crook is believed to be from the area near the Kroger at Ecorse and Monroe. Police say during the crime at about 7 a.m. today, the victim watched her attacker flee westbound on Ecorse Road. Detectives now warning people living in this area to be on the lookout for a white man in his 20s with a thin build, mustache, and brown hair, wearing a white long sleeve shirt, possibly with an American flag, and dark pants, shoes, and hat. Well, I'm sure it's human reaction to go after someone who's taken your property. Uh, we just don't want you to take that chance. Police also on the lookout for that silver colored Jeep Liberty. Anyone with info asked to call Taylor Police right away. Live in Taylor, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. All right, thank you so much, Simon. Coming